The following is a recreated video and audio log found on an abandoned base after a Thargoid Revenant attack. The video and audio has been reconstructed and may contain some glitches. I pulled the L6 from inside the storage area and checked its ammo. Three in the clip, three clips hanging from the bottom. A realistic weapon. I was confident that the L6 could kill these drones quite easily, I just had to time the shots right and not take out too many so the scouts didn't deploy more. Back to the second storage compartment. I cut the red hatch open and gasped. A power core. It looked like it was degraded from the crash, but maybe it would be enough to send a short range signal? Now you might think it's odd that a lowly cleaner, a maintenance guy, would know any of this, but before I had a family, before I was cleaner, I was a member of the Pilots Federation. I flew ships across the galaxy, destroyed pirates, raided settlements and explored planets, discovered new life and visited black holes. But one day I'd gone a step too far. Coming back from a long exploration, I'd flown too close to a pirate settlement. They shot me down, destroyed my ship, stole my materials, my suits, my credits, my weapons. The rescue rangers had found me days later, floating in my escape pod, badly beaten, broken body and spirit. They had gotten me back on track after months of medical treatment, I was ready to go again. They offered me a stock sidewinder and some credits so I could start over. I declined. I told them to keep the ship. I took the 15,000 credits and I stuck my feet this time. I hadn't flown since. I tried my hand at being a guard, getting trained in settlement repairs and weaponry, but none of that was for me. I met someone in a bar one night, started a family, made a living and potentially lost it all again. I snapped back to the present, a Thargoid roaring sounding out as a cyclops buzzed the base. It was time to repair the comms. I started making my way to the command building with my supplies in tow, running between crates when I needed to, keeping out of the drone's search beams. I shot one that I couldn't avoid with a huge explosion that fell to the ground. I skirted around the wreck, avoiding the green gas that it emitted. The other drones didn't even seem to notice as I destroyed the one in my way, but a few seconds later a scout buzzed and dropped more off, so the drones weren't linked to each other, but the scouts could somehow tell if they were attacked and their numbers dropped. I pulled the damaged cap power converter from the other hatch and then set my eyes on the command building.